I didn't know you was gonna start out with it. Looking a for a city bit. built above. Looking for a city where I'll never die. For our homes renewed. Here we go. Looking for a city. Night of Destruction number four of season five of the Low Budgets. We've done two events, the Enduro and the Skid Plate Race, and it is time to finish things off with the trailer race. Now, during preparations, you guys saw us working on Twilight Sparkle, my trailer race car, the good old Cadillac, mm -hmm. doing good. But when we got to the track, Tommy, this earlier today, we started to put some gas in the car and you noticed something that was not good. Noticed two things. I smelt one and I saw the other. Yeah. And they were both related. I smelt a lot of gas thinking, well, it's probably this gas can. And then I looked underneath and it was dripping. Mm -hmm. Dripping fluid. You have a hole in your gas tank. Yeah. So this car has like a plastic gas tank that, mm -hmm. that it came with. Uh, not like the older cars that we were dealing yeah. with. But uh, so we never bothered uh, with the changing out the fuel cell or anything with this car um didn't think we needed to didn't think we needed to and and yeah so this thing actually has a leak so there's going to be we're going to have to kind of go to the drawing board on how to fix this but immediately we knew this isn't something that we have time to deal with and usually with with holes that involve liquids like gas or oil you got to give it a 24 hour mm -hmm. prep time to dry we didn't have 24 hours no we had eight yeah so <laughs> so that's why in the last race by the way, if you'll recall, the car shut off. We weren't sure what it exactly was for. Well, it was because the car ran out of gas. Yep. Like, it completely just went. So so that happened. Um, so what we knew uh, a little bit closer to the event is that I wasn't going to be running the event. And that kind of worked out because we were scrambling to find a trailer for me to pull. We only had one trailer for all Team Low Budget. Shayla's car had been fixed. You guys worked on it. Got it ready to go. She's got the Batmobile ready to go in the trailer race. So we know that Shayla will be in the trailer race. Now, I'm going to backtrack a little bit. First things first, Shayla just competed in the all-female demolition derby that they that they like to do at this track once a year. So Irwindale hosted that event. Shayla went in. Here are the highlights from the demolition derby. Powder Puff Derby. It's about to get started. You're kind of seeing some, some background stuff here. Yeah, usually we're out there, but it's a girl's turn. So we're over here. So Shayla's way over there. I mean, who are you rooting for? I don't know. Besides, let's say besides no, Shayla. No, of course. Because Shayla's the obvious, but who do you want to do the best? I'm rooting for Q. Me too. Because, because she always has something weird happen in her car.
So she had two Batmobiles out there, and Tommy, the derby ended kind of quick for Shayla. Yeah, something went wrong there. It looked like she backed into a car to make a decent hit, and something died. So it's yeah. got to be electrical, probably. Um, this car didn't seem like it would have any other problem. The way it was running, somewhat strong. Yeah. So bummer for her. Couldn't uh, defend an, or couldn't grab another Powderpuff Derby win. But she's got another Batmobile. Yeah, she does. And I got to say that the uh, the females, they hit hard in oh, the yeah. female derby. Don't mess around. I like how it took us five seconds before we had a car on top of yep. another one. Mm -hmm. And that's always hot. So getting ready for the trailer race coming up here, Tommy. You and I don't have cars for this. Shayla's nope. ready to go. She's, she's basically ready to pull on track right now with her trailer. But you already kind of had a plan, and I became part of that plan. Yeah. What were you going to do in this race? Well, the track needed another person to drive the Irwindale Jam car. Well, I figured if you don't have a car out there, why not join me? Yeah. So I feel like at halfway or close to it, we're going to switch. Yeah, so we're going we're gonna to have some fun. It's always been a dream of mine ever since I was a kid to drive a police car. I wanted to actually be a police officer once when I was younger because I was like, oh, the cool, the cools are cars. The yeah. cars are cool. Mm -hmm. So I cannot wait to get my first opportunity to drive my first ever police car. We're going to have fun with this one. The trailer race is now. So, Tommy, uh, we're right now driving around in a cop car. Why? What's happening? What well, happened tonight? You and I don't have trailer cars ready. So we took it upon ourselves to do our own thing. Is it me or do we have three derby cars about to race? No, it looks like See, they don't mess with the police car. So there's Shayla. There's, I love it. We got Cheryl. What up? No, not yet. I'll have one for the trailers. I'll have one for the trailers. Go get him, Janie. Get Wait, do, are these both airbags? Heck yeah. Nice. I've always wanted to kick cock bars. Right, I know. You, we've always wanted to drive one or ride in one that was okay to. So yeah, so we, uh, we're we done for the night, essentially. Yeah, we're, we're done and just We're done started. competing, now we can have fun. Yeah. But it's you, up to the girls now. That skip player is fun. Was it? Yeah, I think it might have been. You look like you were handling that thing. You only, the, I only saw you spin once. Oh, I spun more than once. No, I know, but yeah. I only saw you spin once. Oh, then it was once, you're right. Yeah. What do you think, you run the show? Who do you think you are? Buck a lot? Yeah, I am. <laughs> Pick up cameras. Yeah. How does it drive? It drives like a cop car. That's what I'm right now. Steve 
There you go! phone recording. Dude, 
There's a massive robbery happening right yeah, there. Yeah, where are we going? I'm trying to get to the derby car. There you go. There you go. Holy crap. Look at that. 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 Get off his phone while he's driving. <laughs> Who does he think he is? I think we're out of trailer racing, we're just rivals now. Look, yeah, they're literally just wrecking each other.
Yeah, it was. Destruction has completed. That being Night of Destruction number four of season five of the Low Budgets. And Tommy, that was a lot of fun. You know what? You don't get an opportunity very much to drive a police car at least into things. Yeah. So that's what we were doing. So yeah, it's fun. I've got the chance to do it before. This is your first chance. Mm -hmm. uh, so I gotta ask, you know, you've been competing. You and I have both won the events of trailer races before. What was it like to cause problems out oh, there? So so it was a it was it was it, I'd say good, bad, and ugly. 
All right, it was, it, the good part about it was obviously getting to, to push stuff around. I'm driving a police car. Uh, that car's got some decent motor behind it. Uh, so that was, that was just, it was so much fun, just like you said, causing problems out there. Um, I'd say the, uh, the, the bad and the ugly part of it, though, is that being out there in that car, I just, I'm like, I gotta drive through stuff. Yeah, and I know, you're not getting you scored. Got, you gotta pull yeah. it back a little yeah. bit. So, so yeah, no, it was fun. I, I had a lot of fun driving mm. that thing around. Um, I'm, thanks for letting me join you in that Why car. Why not? Yeah. Uh, now, a lot of people might be wondering about one thing that happens in this trailer race, which was kind of weird. Um, while we were driving around, at some point you see us pushing a car that looks like it was in the women's demolition derby, mm -hmm. and that's because someone forgot to get out of their car. Yeah. What happened? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea, but this particular driver just thought that they had a good seat for the trailer race. So Leo, Leo the line. The problem was that this driver <laughs> had a good seat for the trailer race. The trailer race became closer to her, <laughs> and I'm just impressed that no one else noticed. Like, you were halfway through the race. <laughs> like, how did nobody notice? That was, that was officiating weird. or the EMT, yeah. fire rescue people. I'm pretty sure what happened is someone walked up and went, you need help? No. Nah. Okay. Bye. <laughs> and then she almost was in the middle of the trailer. Yeah, no, I mean, we've seen those cars get pushed out before, oh, yeah. so she was going to at least have to steer it out of the mm -hmm. trouble. But, uh, yeah, it, that was a lot of fun. Now, Shayla's car, Tom, it looks like it had an issue. And she was running cool out there. Everything was good. She was bumping into things, and she bent up fenders and buckled her hood. Mm -hmm. Something with the steering, though. So I don't know what happened. She said that um, the car wasn't turning she had to park it because uh when we got to her car afterwards uh -huh. i checked it out maybe went to see what the issue was and then i turned the steering wheel well that thing spun like wheel of fortune so not good something in the steering box i imagine is broken Hmm. So, so something that is going to need to be addressed. Of course. Something that so. needs to be fixed before the next one, for yeah. sure. All right. Well, we know that we have a couple months in between uh, now and our next night of destruction, which yep. means we'll probably only spend one day working on everything, as usual. But overall, Tommy, what what did you think of this night of destruction? We uh, Obviously, you <laughs> didn't participate a lot. I yet. thought, you know, I had the best fun out there. Yeah, right? But you did have fun. Yeah. Um, I, was, I was mostly happy with how things turned out. I had some rivalries, got roughed up a little bit. But, uh, you know, overall, these Night of Destructions are always a blast. If you're ever in the area, come and check them out at Irwindale Speedway. Um, yeah, you never know what you're going to see at these events. And that's one reason why we have 20 oh, yeah. cameras running at these events. So Absolutely. Yeah. So uh, that's a wrap on Night of Destruction number four of season five of the Low Budgets. We've already got work to do, and we're going to do it in our next upload. Extra hard. Just saying, that's another great trailer race idea. Hmm. Judy Hopps' police car. Oh. Put the ears on and then paint it blue and white. And uh, and then she'll be pulling a uh, jail. There you go. Fuck it. Make it happen. So, 2020. I'll... <laughs> <laughs>